Okay, girls, to finish off well-being week, we have this page here and it's called looking after yourself. Now, if you haven't got a printer, that's no problem, but it might be good to write out the six boxes into your copy, okay? Or leave a page for each box. So take up six pages. But what I've done is I've thought about the ways that I can look after myself each day and to keep going with those things going forward. So I'm going to read you my examples that are for me. Yours are going to be different for you, okay? Number one, to look after yourself, you need to talk to others about how you feel. We know that that's very important to talk, okay? And the ways I'm going to do that is I'm going to chat to my mom and call my friends, okay? They're the people I go to. To look after yourself, you need to eat a balanced diet, okay? So for me, it's porridge for my breakfast, healthy breakfast, and water all day. I'll try to sip my water throughout the day, and there's my water for today. Okay, to look after yourself, you need to do some exercise. So what I've been doing at the moment is uh, I go for a walk every day and I'm trying to swim in the sea um, just once a week at the moment. So that's for me. So yours is going to be different, as I said. To look after yourself, you need to look after your personal hygiene. So every day I'm brushing my teeth and I'm having a shower every day to make sure I'm nice and clean. Okay, it's good for your skin. To look after yourself, you need to think about what you wear. So for myself... I like to wear warm clothes, okay? I know the weather is improving, but it's still a bit cold outside, so I'm going to wear clothes that keep me warm because I'll be happy when I'm warm. And I'm making sure that I'm wearing clean clothes as well because you it actually makes you feel so much better. Um, so your parents probably do your washing for you at home, but it might be a good time to learn um, how to put a clothes wash on uh, since we're not in school but again that's up to your own house and how you do things but yeah clean clothes always makes you feel better look after yourself you need to rest and to sleep we know sleep is very important for all aspects of our life okay so for me my bedtime I'm still setting it even though we're not going into work but we're still getting up for work so bedtime I'm making sure I'm in bed every evening by half 10 and I am setting an alarm every morning for eight usually so I mean, even though we don't have, uh, we don't have to be out the door by a certain time these days. It's still good to keep a bedtime and a morning time to get up at because if we go out of routine, then different things, um, in our life get affected. Okay, if you get up too late, you might not be eating a breakfast, so you might be straight into a lunch. So you're missing out on extra nutrients you can get when you have your breakfast. You've less time to be drinking your water, less time to be, um, you know, sitting down to do your schoolwork. OK, so it does have a knock on effect. So it is good to try keep a routine um, of your bedtime and setting alarms to get up in the morning. Now, your times will probably be different to mine. Everyone's is different, but it's good to get the same times or roughly the same time every day. OK, and we'll get into routine and we'll get easier. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep this sheet, okay? And I might hang it on my wall and it'll remind me every day, if I'm not feeling right, have I followed my six steps to make myself feel better and to look after myself? 